Hey, what's up guys? Matt here with CF Pro Tools Support and I want to make a quick video and show you a new add-on, the Bump Quantity add-on and uh, quickly how that works. So if you're using a one-step or two-step order form and you uh, maybe you have a bump, uh, maybe some tickets or some shirts, um, physical product of some sort and you're like, I want to offer the ability to give them quantities of said bump product, um, you can use this add-on to uh, make that work. So I'm gonna go through here real quick and just show you what I've got set up. Um, so I've got a core product set up and a single bump, okay? So uh, what I'm gonna do is say, yes, I wanna take the bump. This is just a bump selector box. Um, you can set this up in your settings to show or hide the bump box in this, the, the two-step order. Or in a one-step, this is actually its own uh, bump element. So either way, you're going to add that in. If I click the, the little box and say, yes, I want it, um, you'll, you'll notice that nothing actually shows up here, but it does show the quantity indicator. So it's similar to cart mode in that manner, uh, but it doesn't actually add anything to the cart until you select a quantity. So there's my bump product. It added a quantity. If I say I want three, it puts three, tallies up a total over here and then uh, even five. So um, that's pretty much it. Uh, that's how it works. Once you go through with the order, complete the order, it works just like any other cart. Um, I would recommend playing around with this. Uh, try it out. This will work with cart mode as well, okay? So uh, I will see you guys in the next video. I'm going to show you guys exactly how to set this up, okay? Take care.